The number you have dialed has been changed. The new number is... Please note, the new number is... around Africans, Dominicans, and Puerto Ricans. You know what we don't have in the Bronx? Pooper scoopers. White people, we need you in the Bronx so you can show these motherfuckers how to pick up their dog shit. <laughs> they say 40 is the new 20. Fuck 40, I'm 42. Can't see shit, can't piss straight. <laughs> when you 20 and you go out on a date, you want dinner and a movie with a nice smile. 40, dating, you wanna fuck, doggy style. Since I'm fucking, this guy took me to a club. The DJ played, drop it like it's hot. I dropped what I thought it was and my uterus fell out. <laughs> I had to pick the motherfucker up and twist my ass somewhere and sit down. What's up, comic strip? <laughs> this guy told me he liked me. I was so excited until he said, don't tell nobody, not even your mama. I was like, fuck you, my mama can keep a secret. She still haven't told me who my daddy is. <laughs> Yo, know, fuck that bitch. Don't even tell your mama. Then he's gonna ask me if I have a tramp stamp. You guys know what a tramp stamp is? That's a tattoo on your lower back. If you wanna call a woman a tramp stamp, she's some bitch that took 30 men to the Maury Porvi show, been C-sectioned. That means the baby came out her belly and she still don't know who her baby daddy is. Tramp stamp that bitch. Yo, the brother that was up here before looked like the guy I was making out with this guy under the boardwalk. We were making out, and all of a sudden, he got shot. The police said, I heard you call rape. I said, I called ape. Don't the motherfucker look like an ape? I didn't call rape. He's an ape. I love you people. God bless you guys. At the comic strip, I'm loving it. Yo, yo anybody out there know what sheet rock is? It's, yeah, it's some cardboard shit that should come with instructions. Never have a nail and sheetrock. The hole gets like this and it gets bigger and bigger. And if you live in the Bronx, you got a rat hole or peephole. peep hole. Like, what the fuck is Mommy Chula doing tonight? <laughs> I was sitting in my living room. I heard a big bang. I turned around, there was an elbow on my wall. I'm like, is that a fucking elbow? I don't know what the man next door and his wife was doing. Only thing I know, the bitch elbow was dangling in my living room for 15 minutes to the fire department had to come and take her ass out the wall. Every time I see her now, I'll be like, what's up, elbow? What the fuck is going on tonight? Say the fuck out of my living room. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. Make a black woman come. <laughs> make me feel like, yo, can I make your liver quiver, baby? Can I make your liver quiver? Yo, I'm hanging out with white people. Yeah. I love them, right? They be like, did someone spin out a fucking watermelon sea and then she landed in front of the crowd? They took me to a club on 28th Street. I'm in the club, I see all these beautiful black men that look like Tyler Perry. I went up to this guy, I said, hey sweetie, what's your name? You know what the big motherfucker said? Lady. I was like, lady? I got a penis. He said, show it to me. I said, you think I walk around with 13 inches strapped on all day? The shit is at home in my drawer. <laughs> Fuck you. And then he was like, yo, since I couldn't get no dick in there, I started looking at the pussy. I said, maybe I eat that shit like a shrimp fried rice. <laughs> Try to get nasty up here in the comic strip. Yeah, bring it, baby. Have a good fucking time in the comic strip. I work for the Board of Education. Most of them badass kids need to be left behind the nearest detention center. I was attacked on a job by a sumo six-year-old kindergarten. Picked me up, slammed me down, stuck his thumb in his mouth, I was like, ah, nah, nah, mom. I was like, my mama dead, but I wanted to help. The principal asked me, like, how do you keep them all in order? I said, every time I know you coming, I stick a cherry lifesaver in their mouth. You ever seen 36 people sucking on a cherry lifesaver? There's unity in a black community. You can't use no other fucking lifesaver, just a cherry. 
Before I came here, I stopped in Times Square. There's a white man standing in the middle of Times Square wearing a cowboy hat playing a good talk only in his underwear. On the ass part of his drawers, he got the words naked cowboy painted in red. Now we all know, yo ape, you hear me baby? If a black man was standing in the middle of Times Square only in his underwear, the cops would lock his ass up. <laughs> Not because he black for packing a 357. <laughs> they were like, boy, who you think you are? Nate Love, AKA Deadwood Dick? This ain't no rodeo in Times Square. Thank you, comic strip. She works for the Board of fucking Ed. <laughs> I, I, I had nothing to joke about that. That's funny in and of itself. Next guy coming to the stage is Rel